We live in an information economy. In an information economy, the technology you use becomes awfully important because how are we acquiring information? How are we storing information? How do we make it available to our employees? How do we analyze that information? And, and what, how are we gaining knowledge or insight from that information? Those competitors who figure out how to harness the big data, how to harness big compute, so that together they can actually run those workflows and get answers, those competitors are going to win. We are actually uh, producing more and more information. And in order to be able to mine that information for value, um, you have this concept of big data. It is really the analysis and the analytics that you have around that data that can really drive you know, what your product strategy is, what your service strategy is. You can gather information about you know, what your customers are doing. It seems fairly obvious, but if you were to ask most companies today, they will tell you, we know how to collect the data. We know how to store the data. We actually don't know what to do with the data. Big data is around volume, uh, velocity, and variety. Those three Vs tell you something about your business and whether or not the strategy you know, that you have defined needs to be changed or altered. Well, what's interesting about big data is that it allows companies and organizations to predict the future. If you think about it, for the first time, we have sufficient data at hand and sufficient compute power to be able to analyze that data, run simulations, and determine a likely outcome. We have done some studies where for every dollar that a business invests in big data technology, uh, they have been able to come back and show a greater than $10 business value as a result. You should start off with an intention and a purpose. What is it that you're trying to glean from that information? Most companies are still in the mode where what they can do is they can collect the data, store the data, and maybe draw a few pretty pie charts. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about running intense analysis and simulations against that to actually predict likely outcomes. When you have a big data project, you have varying sources of information, uh, much of it unstructured data. Unlike other business data historically that's been more structured, that you could correlate and had sort of a hierarchy about it. You have to have um, initially, you know, a, uh, a strategy or you know, a purpose for why you're looking at the data. Big data analysis can be used to bring in new revenue. A very common practice these days is to analyze big data to find out what new products and services should be sold to an individual consumer. Through big data analysis, you can identify uh, what are some areas for improvement in, um, in operations. We've done some really, really forward-looking things to create population care tools, which are very transformative for how our doctors and how our clinical staff really change the conversation with patients by using data to understand any care challenges that patient has and overcoming that challenge on their behalf proactively. Whether it's predicting it'll be a dry season in Nebraska this year for growing corn and wheat and other types of things, or curing cancer by crawling through the human genome for an individual patient, or determining what will happen if I raise or lower the price on a given product that my company is offering. If you have your strategy correct and your purpose correct to start with, I think you'll find that it'll be very valuable. The first thing that I would do as a board member is ask, so tell me, what is the outcome? How are we gonna use this data to make data-driven decisions in our business on a regular basis? Do we have the ability and the computational power, which in many cases companies do not, 
to actually run the analysis and the simulation of all that data so that we're actually doing more than just collecting and storing it, which is pretty much the norm today. Investment in big data appliances and the technologies is not trivial. You have the right personnel, right, that can actually analyze that data so that you see productivity improve. If the board can have a, a single snapshot of the key uh, decision making, what's driving the business from an external standpoint, what the external factors are, as well as the internal data within the organization, that's tremendously powerful for board of directors to actually see how the business is moving. But it's really around what value are you getting from that analysis? How can you really see the value of that information?